bold climate action means to reduce emissions across sectors worldwide by half by 2030. This year, we have the global stock take of the Paris Agreement. We are assessing how the Paris Agreement is doing. We are assessing what is going on and up to what point we are implementing this Paris Agreement. With that result, every country has to improve the national targets, improve the way they are addressing climate change, and not only the emissions, but also the amount of efforts they are putting in adapting to new climate, to the new climate that we are having the new climate impacts that we're experiencing. And this is something that is really crucial if we want to stay below below 1.5 and also to address justice in our communities. Reducing global greenhouse gas emissions by half is something that has to be reflected in the next round of NDCs across sectors in all countries in different ways according to their own responsibilities. We at the Independent Global Stock Take in Latin America and the Caribbean work with different organizations across the region to not only engage properly in the Global Stock Take process of the UNFCCC and the Paris Agreement, but also to do our own assessments in Latin America. That's why we released very recently an, an independent assessment of the performance of the region in Latin America to help countries to identify those gaps to help countries and civil society to push for the right direction in each of the countries in our region for complementing the outcomes of the global stock take that will come up in this COP and to address much stronger and more adequate NDCs by 2025 with all this information. Civil society remains engaging as much as possible in this process and outside the process in countries as well to actually have a much better commitment from our own government into the climate action that is needed for having a safe climate in the future. We call upon you, the world leaders, to come and back up and give the signals that are requested and are needed to actually have a stronger and much more serious way forward to stay below 1.5 and stay and achieve this safe climate that we all want for.